Hello and thanks for watching this video and subscribing to our YouTube channel. In this series of videos for Acumatica 2021 R1, we're going to talk about a new inquiry screen called Dead Stock. What this allows you to do is to find out what inventory you have that has no movement on it. So you can see at the top of the screen, we have a warehouse selection. So if we select wholesale, for example, and we can also filter by the item class. So maybe we have a certain category of item in mind or a specific inventory ID. And you can select by days or a certain date. So if we select by days, we can say in stock for 30 days or plus 60 days. And if we say no sales for, we can also filter based on that. So this gives us the ability to see stock that's been stagnant, that has not moved in our system. The results show you your in stock quantity, your dead stock quantity, meaning beyond 30 days, this is the quantity that we have a problem with. 1892 is over 30 days. Over here, we can see the in dead stock and the number of days for it. This is the last sale date of this item and its last cost. And you can see here, this is the total dead stock cost. So if we take the dead stock item average cost, we multiply by the dead stock quantity. That's what this number represents. This is helpful because we could take this stock that's now aging over 30 days and maybe run a special on it to get it out of our warehouse. Also notice we can select by days or date. So if we click on that, that gives us in stock since or no sales since. So these are different filters you can use to really carve up what your stock is doing and how it's hanging around or not hanging around. So that's it. That's the new dead stock inquiry screen in Acumatica 2021 R1. If you have any questions about this or any other feature in Acumatica, feel free to reach out to us. We'd love to hear from you. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.